Hey guys, Zulma here, and welcome back to episode 2 of Starbound. Um, we created some crafting wrenches for ourselves last episode, and we are ready to try and make ourselves um, a new weapon and some armor. Um, so we basically need to get some iron, um, some plant fibers for woven fabric, and uh, a piece of string, I think. Um, that's basically what we need there, basically just iron, woven fabric, and string for all of this stuff. Um, I did also see, just when I was walking around, just looking at the ship a little bit, uh, just before I started recording this episode, um, there's actually a, a cupboard here that has a bunch of canned food, ten torches, and a flashlight. So, um, that would have been very helpful. Um, we can get that out now, that's going to help. And I also completely forgot about the fact that there is hunger in this game, so the tin food will come in useful. You can see here there's an orange bar just underneath my uh, energy. That, I believe, is my hunger. So, let's go back down to the planet. <clears throat> and uh, let's see... Oh, it's still dark. Okay, at least we've got our flashlight out now, though. That's good. Um, let's see what we can find. I should probably look at getting a shelter put together fairly soon so we actually have sort of some sort of base on the planet i know i put all my crafting stuff up in the ship for now but it would be nice to have like a bit of a home base as well um to be able to you know retreat to when we need to oh we don't die to this creature already i think there's another one there okay Oh no, this is the bit that was all flooded. Um, what if we dig down? That should hopefully make the water level drop a little bit. I have turned the volumes down a little bit from last episode as well, because I listened back to it and I think it was uh, a little bit loud. <laughs> struggling to hear me. Uh, so hopefully that is noticeably better as well. Now, where's my flashlight? Okay, what we got over there? Uh, looks like we can just about make it through here without drowning, which is... <laughs> Always always a good idea not to drown. I would not recommend drowning. Um, okay, a bit of coal here. We're looking for iron, basically, and whatever plant fibers we can find will be useful. But plant fibers, I feel, are a little bit easier to gather. So they're just sort of like hanging everywhere in the caves, like this. <clears throat> but the iron is what is what has been basically been eluding us for a little bit. So I'm going to gather some plant fibers while I can find them. And hopefully... We'll run into some iron down here uh, and not run into too much trouble. Now, I think we can yeah, continue to do this. I don't know how deep this works. Oh my god, please don't kill me. Oh god, okay, that's... Oh! Oh, what the hell? He goes into little people. Oh, that was not good. Uh, that was really not good. Hang on. I think I have some healing stuff here. A bandage resource 50 health. In one second, the salve does it in a bit of a longer time, but that's fine. We'll use one of those. I don't know how much health I actually have. But, uh... <clears throat> okay. We're looking a little better now. We get this copper while I'm here. I'm not actually sure what the copper is used for, to be honest. But I'm sure we will need it at some point. Plant fibers too. Just gonna, yeah, I don't see the need to waste torches while I can just do Oh! Oh no! Oh, fuck. Do you fall, yeah, fall down the hole. Oh god, uh, where's my torch? Here's the torch. Um, well this is the flashlight, not torch. Where are my actual torches? Cause that's, that's what I need. Let's put a torch up there. Um, well, that was interesting. I don't have many of these, though, so we're going to have to make them last. I've only got seven left. Okay. Right. Ah, uh, there. You fell down there. Right. Uh, we need to heal ourselves up quite rapidly, and we also need to use some of this food, I think. What is that? Oh, a wheat seed. Okay, I thought it was like a coin or something. Okay, if we eat that, there we go. Now we've got our, our hunger is back to full again. Excellent. Um, so I'm not sure what this place is down here. I'm still a little bit paranoid about that creature coming for us. But, oh, can he jump up this high is the question. Oh, apparently so. Okay, looks like we can just sort of save spot from here though, hopefully. 
don't know if the little ones can get up here. The one that's iron there, it's going to make a gap, though, isn't it? There we go. Oh, nearly got him. Okay, he's down. Come on, little guys. Time to die, I'm afraid. Probably for me, not them, but... <laughs> Okay, okay. What did we pick up there? What's that? Silver ore. Okay, interesting. Ooh, somewhat iron. <clears throat> That's what we're looking for. Now, I did a little rough calculation of what materials we'd need, need, and I think we need about 32 iron ore in total to make the uh, armor and the sword. Oh, that's a lot of that's a lot of sand. Oh, what's, what's this? Oh, what is what is killing me? Oh my god! Heal, please. For God's sake, this is not how I wanted this to to start. What's in here? Hunting spear. And some pixels. Right, okay. So we can... I feel like I've maybe explored a little bit too deep for, you know, like my second day in this place. That looks dangerous down there. I see that is iron though. I don't want to die for it. Okay, we got. Oh, we got some plant matter as well. Okay, let's go. Oh, I forgot there was a massive gap there. That's gonna screw me over more than once. I'm telling you now, it's gonna happen. <clears throat> we also only have a single torch left, which is not great. We really could do with some more. I'm assuming we can just use coal and like wood, as like you do with most of these survival games. But I'm not 100% sure how it works. Uh, let's put the torch up like there. Okay. Oh, there's a bunch of coal up there. If we get some dirt and then build a little a platform, then hopefully we can get some of this coal that's up here and make ourselves some torches. Now, I don't know if we need a crafting bench for these or whether we can just make them. If we could just make them, that would be beautiful. Some of this we might lose to the water underneath, but hopefully not. Cool, we got it. Um, now, I don't want to go too far without any more torches. Speaking of, can we make... We can indeed. Okay, coal and wooden logs. So, uh, let's just... Let's just make a crap ton of torches, to be honest. We're going to need them. Definitely are going to need these. Okay, nearly done. Excellent. And I'm pretty sure we need at least one rope. So I'm going to make a rope. Uh, okay, and we're going to put the torches back in... Where are my torches? Oh, that's a lot of torches. I didn't expect that many. Oh, wow. Okay, 192. Well, we're set for torches then. That's good to know. Uh, we are kind of out of our salve, though, which is unfortunate. Uh, we have bandages, but I don't, I don't want to waste them. It's probably a good idea to have them on the hot bar anyway, isn't it? She's magic! Okay, that's terrifying. More coal. Oh, there's a snail. Snail deed. Uh, 
we are not looking too good. I'm going to use one of those bandages. Okay, we need to get better at combat because I suck at it right now. another one of those onion people. Okay, well, this is a dead end at least. We'll get this copper. Really good deal with upgrading this mining tool. Oh. Can I, like, save spot? annoying because you really can't like aim it, it just sort of swings in a very wide arc. It's going to get some more plant fibre because there's a ton of it here. And then I think we need to probably start heading more towards the surface because uh, I am not prepared to be down here. Painful drop. They didn't make it. Uh, okay, and then get some dirt. Oh, we've already got some whatever that is. Okay, let's build ourselves a bridge. Can we see the daylight yet? Oh, we can. Okay, cool. Um, right, let's... See if we can... Jump up there. Yep. Okay. Okay, right, we still need more iron, and we should probably build ourselves a house, actually. Now, let's kind of see where we beam down from, and then I'll put our house near that. Because I want to be kind of, like, close to where we beam down for the base to be built. Okay, it's right here. So, um, this is not really a very flat area, is it? Um, okay, this is, oh, this is really not a great area, actually. I suppose we could have flattened it out. We did sort of dig straight down, but there's a cave right there. Uh, we could have flattened out this hill, I guess. We'll cut down the trees. We'll make some sort of base on this hill, I think. Man, these take a long time <clears throat> to cut down. Okay, we're gonna need the wood anyway, so... Come on! <laughs> there we go. Take the time. Cool, right. So, if we just sort of... I don't know, I guess like... Try and flatten it out from here-ish. Sort of thing. Uh, at least daytime is coming now, so we should be able to see what we're doing a little better.
Do 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 Okay, and then what we can actually do is we could have this sort of like cave trapdoor thing be like an underground layer or something like that, so. So let's get rid of all this dirt for the time being. And then what I will do, I think, just for now as well, is I'm just going to fill in that hole just so we got, you know, like a rough sort of area to build with. <coughs> Finally done there. Um, now I think we should build this out of wood or timber at least. Where's our right timber? I'm pretty sure you don't need like proper wood for a lot of stuff. You can just use timber. Although actually saying that, I'm pretty sure actually you need wooden logs for torches. So we've just we've just lied there, but it's okay. We're gonna need this wood to, uh, to build our house, so let's just, uh, yeah, do it, I guess. Um, I don't know how tall it should be. Let's just go with that for now, I think. And then, like, oh, not quite like that. And then to do the back Can we not do the back? Oh, we can. There we go. So the thing that I struggle with most when I first started playing games like Terraria is building the background bits of buildings. Because you always end up missing a piece. I'm going to get rid of all of this just so we can uh, <coughs> have it all nice and be... Uh, have it all just be timber. That's the plan at least. help if this one a little bit faster but it's okay I think now that I think about it I remember playing this game a little bit a long time ago you don't necessarily I don't think get upgraded tools but you're basically you can see at the moment like when I dig or play stuff it's in a block of four and I think when you upgrade your tool the like it just gets bigger so you end up having like a, a three by three or a four by four instead of this little two by two square I think so uh, we'll see how that plays out, I guess. Come on. Get in there. Man, this is so slow. Jeez, I probably shouldn't have built it this big, to be honest. As like a first base, we should have built it smaller and then just like expanded it when we needed the space. But hey, go big or go home, right? We're going to do this. We're going to do it properly. I have enough timber to fill it. Oh, missed the spot. Okay, and then actually I don't know if we do have enough timber. Oh, I don't think we do. No, we're going to run out. Yep. Uh, well, crap. <laughs> well, this, is, this needs to be a door, so... And this can be a door. That's all the wood used up. Let's go get some more. And I'll just put some torches on the inside to light it up a little bit. That isn't quite the same, is it? Is that the same? I think that's the same now. Yeah, that looks about right. Cool. Right. Let's get some more wood. What the hell is that? 
It's a crazy, crazy looking bird up there. Oh, please don't try and fight me. I just want to cut down some wood, guys. Leave me alone. Don't attack me at the same time, for the love of God. This is not the time. Okay. We got a bit lucky there. He came at us individually. Although we are quite low on health now. Oh, and hunger, actually. Maybe that's, that's probably not helping with the uh, health regen. I don't know if you actually do regen health. That's the other thing. I'm really not sure about. Oh, yeah. I literally just got a message about hunger. Nope. Little fucker. Okay, I need that wood down there. Cool. Hopefully this is enough timber to finish the base off, because like, it is getting dark and I would like somewhere to uh somewhere safe to stay. But having to continuously beam up to my ship. Okay, uh, timber. I know we could just use like dirt or something, but it's not the same, you know. It's not the same. Cool. Um, that's gonna annoy me. There's like a little bit at the bottom there that's still dirt. Cool. There we go. Uh, now we actually need to make. Can we make doors? I don't think we can. I think we need to beam up to our ship to make doors. From the actually no no we have the furniture thing oh, we can... it's in our inventory <laughs> my bad my bad so I think I actually have I think it's this one it's probably what we need Let's place that down it is indeed so we can make wooden doors so... okay let's make two wooden doors Sweet. We can put a door in there. And we can put a door in there. Spruce the place up a bit with a few more torches. That'll do. And while we're here, we may as well put our, uh, our other station thing down. There we go. Okay, we don't have any windows because we haven't made any glass or anything like that. So we'll have to work on that. Is the only way to get health back, literally, to... Wait a minute, can we make, like, a bed or something to sleep in? Wooden hatch. Ah, iron bed. Wooden bed. We need woven fabric. Okay, I'm pretty sure I can make that. Let me shut the door. In the ship. Let's do that. Uh, woven fabric. Let's just make it all into woven fabric. Do, do, do. Wow. Okay, there we go. Right, let's go back down. So we may as well put some torches out on the ground so I can actually see what's around as well. Probably not a bad idea. And we'll put a little torch on the front as well. Why not? Okay. Uh, so, a wooden bed or an iron bed. I don't think there's much difference so we're gonna make one of these I'm assuming that this is actually like lets me sleep and heal but I really don't know so this could be a pointless endeavor aha we can sleep it does heal our health excellent okay just very very slowly by the looks of things um, but hey it's better than wasting my last bandage I guess isn't it uh, maybe the iron bed heals faster I don't know but I don't want to waste iron because I need it Let's, uh, well, let's, let's get out of bed for just a second. This needs to not be a big hole, because I will die. I will fall down that so many times, and it will, it will just be silly. Let's see how we're doing on the iron front. I know we don't, I don't, pretty sure we don't have anywhere near the amount of iron that we need, but how many can we make? Seven, that is 
nowhere near what we need, as I suspected. Um, so, we can make a loincloth or a circlip. Ooh, we could make, ah, uh, we could get the breastplate if we make a piece of string. And we need three more rope to make the iron broadsword. Um... Ooh, I don't know if we have the materials to make a piece of string. Wait, was it rope or string? I keep getting confused. It's string. Okay, we need string. So that's here. Make a piece of string. There we go. Breastplate. Let's make that because I think that gives the highest, yeah, the highest bonuses. So. Cool, right, so, we now should have, wherever it's gone, there we go, protective breastplate, cool, um, so, we need, oh, actually, we can make another one of these, the circlet or the loincloth, it's got to be the circlet, it gives more, doesn't it, yep, uh, also, it looks badass. Who doesn't want like a big red feather sticking out of the head? It doesn't look obnoxious at all. <laughs> okay, and we got it on. Nice. Wow, they really are taking the avian thing a little bit too far, aren't they? So, uh, the only thing that we need to do now is we need to get one more iron bar. Actually, that's very close. Do we have... Okay, so we literally just need like two iron ore to make that. Uh, and then for the sword, obviously, we're going to need oh, another five iron bars. Okay, and some rope. Right. Okay. Well, <clears throat> I think maybe we will wrap up this episode here, guys. I'm going to go back down here and get into bed to heal up. Um, we've got two out of the three pieces of armor we wanted, and we don't we don't have the sword, but we did make a little hut for ourselves, a little base for ourselves. We've got a bed that we can heal up in. Uh, it looks like we're going to sleep as the sun is coming up, but oh well. Um, but yeah, other than that, guys, thank you very much for watching. Um, next episode, hopefully, we will finally finish off our armor and get ourselves a new weapon, and then it will be onwards to find whatever mysteries this planet has in store for us. Um, again, thank you very much for watching. If you did enjoy the episode, please give me a, uh, a like on the video and subscribe if you want to see more from me. Other than that, guys, I will see you in the next episode.